Well, John, uh, well done for getting on the match uh, today, mate. Uh, disappointing defeat, though. Uh, what were your thoughts on the game, buddy? I thought the um, first hour or so, I didn't think we were at it. Um, first half, it was here and there. Um, but then second half, we came out slow. Obviously, they took advantage of that. And then it took us a while to get going. And then once we got going, I thought we'd give it a good right go towards the last 20, 25 minutes, maybe. Uh -huh. um, and I thought, to be honest, I thought we could have gotten something out of the game. Um, obviously, we've had a few chances towards the end. And then... Which hasn't quite gone our way. Yeah, yeah, I would agree with you that. Uh, I think the subs made a difference. It just shows we've got a bit of a uh, depth from the bench. Oh, absolutely. We've got a great squad. Um, I thought Vinny, um, thought he was excellent when he came on. Mm -hmm. Crosses and a bit of magic, which he has. Um, I thought Billy done well as well. Yeah, definitely. Um, it was always a tough place. Well, sorry, it is always a tough place to come here. Uh, they are a good team, but I personally thought we gave a really good account of ourselves. Would you agree? Yeah, I mean, these would be up there, probably favourites to win the league or at least go. Oh. Um, I just think on another day, maybe if we give a little bit more first half and a couple of things go our way, I think we could have got some about this game. Yeah, I would, I would agree with you there as well, mate. Um, obviously, you came here this year in pre-season. Can you tell us a bit about yourself and your young career so far? So, I started off Hartlepool United uh, in, in the academy and I was a scholar until I was 18. Um, and then went to same Red Star for about six months or so when I was 18. Great. Um, and then been at Rye and Whitley Bay mainly since then and then here from pre-season. And can I ask why did you decide Sheldon then? Um, well, I've spoke to the, I spoke to the managers, um, the old manager at Rye, I think he knew the, the managers as well and obviously right. when whatever was going on at Rye, sort of obviously before it folded, yeah. um, he just had a chat with them and I think Jamie was already a bit interested from seeing us play against Crook last season. Right. Good. Good club. Good. Um, there's always been a lot of good banter and crack in the dressing room. Are you fitting in with the lads? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, good set of lads. Um, I already knew a few of them anyway, right. uh, which, which always helps. But ah. So I had a new lad to spot them. Good. I think I fit right in. Right in. Good. Um, and what are your personal aspirations, mate, uh, for the season, also for Shilton as a team? I think, personally, I'd like to get 10 goals. <laughs> Got one one ish today, I suppose. Ah. Um, but yeah, I'd like to try and push for 10 goals and probably the same for assists. And then. Team-wise, I'd like to get playoffs. Got that last season. Uh, Shieldon got that last season, and it's got to be the minimum, really. Good. And finally, mate, we have FA Cup game up against Peniston Church at Dean Street on Saturday. Do you think we're good enough to get a result and put our names in the hat for the next round? Oh, absolutely. We're definitely good enough. Uh, I'm not I'm not sure much about Peniston, but in the day, all we've got to do is turn up and play our game and focus on focus on that, and we'll get we'll get the result. Simple as that. Good, John. Thank you very much again. Cheers, mate. Cheers, thank mate. You very much.